Hey everybody, my name is Natalie Duncan Edmonds. I wanted to thank you for listening to this episode of The Morning Show. I'm the creator, the producer, and the host of the show. We want you to check out our website. It's themorningshowwithnatalie.com. You can go to that website. You can see all about our sponsors, all about the show. You can even listen to live episodes while they're going on right there from the, the website. Another way to listen to the show live is go to Live365. You can download that app and just search for The Morning Show. It's right there. Super easy. We want you to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel, if you will. That way you can keep up with what's going on on The Morning Show. Thank you. I hope you enjoy it. Hey friend, it's great to have you tuned into The Morning Show today. Here on The Morning Show, you'll hear your favorite Southern gospel music and some of the classics you'll never forget. And now, the hostess of The Morning Show, Natalie Duncan Emmons. When you wake up to the storm and all you feel are the waves crashing against your boat, you wonder if anybody remembers you or the journey that you're on. When you feel discouraged from what you see on the news or the events going on around you, well, friend, cut it off. Don't look to the left or to the right. Look up. And when everything inside of you is screaming to be afraid, to accept defeat, or to hand our enemy a victory, well, you need to sing. And then keep singing. Sing it some more. For we are God's people. And that's just what God's people do. Well, we sing. We said sing from a laughing heart to sing. When the night is dark, to sing. Let your joy explode and let music fill the air. Set on flashing wings to fill the sky with song, with music in the brook and crashing seas. The wind blew through the threads of grass like fingers through the streams of golden harps and made the meadows sing. Then he said, Sing from a laughing heart to sing when the night. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord, he is God. It is he that hath made us, and not we ourselves. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving, and into his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him, and bless his name. For the Lord is good, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endureth to all. Nothing else to do, see, when something deep inside of you tells you that life is still a wonder just go back your head and see. 
the journey. The journey got me here. The roads at once didn't make sense and now seem crystal clear. I know that faith is greater than doubt and love greater than fear. I'm thankful for the journey. The journey got me here. There were dark and narrow places where I crawled and where I climbed. I had to travel roads that were confusing at the time. There were nights my heart was breaking, and I thought I'd been forsaken. But I'm thankful for the journey. The journey got me here. The roads at once didn't make sense, now seem crystal clear. I know that faith is greater than doubt and love greater than fear. I'm thankful for the journey. The journey got me here. There are many in this moment who are walking through a fire. But let me offer hope because of wisdom I've acquired. I can trust in where the road leads. Looking back at what's behind me. I'm thankful for the journey. The journey got me here. The roads at once didn't make sense. Now seem crystal clear. I know that faith is greater than doubt and love greater than fear. I'm thankful for the journey. The journey got me here. I'm thankful for the journey. The journey got me here. The roads at once didn't make sense. Now seem crystal clear. I know that faith is greater than doubt and love. For the journey, the journey got me here. I'm thankful for the journey, the journey got me here. The roads at once didn't make sense, and now seem crystal clear. I know that faith is greater than doubt, and love greater than fear. I'm thankful for the journey, the journey got me here. Well, that's the steals getting us going with the journey. My name is Natalie Duncan Emmons. You are listening to the morning show. Well, every life should have a target, a goal, or an aim. And any healthy individual, I think, would want to live the best life you can, be the best person you can be, and have the best influence you can have. And in order to do that, well, you've got to aim high. I'm convinced the reason that most people will live a life of little consequence and little influence is because they just aim too low. You aim at what you look at. So if you want to have the right aim, we must look at the Savior. If your heart is set on Jesus, well, you won't focus on what's below you or what's around you. You will focus on the one who is above you. And that's the goal. So we are aiming high today, my friend. Yes, we are. Glad you're listening to The Morning Show. This one is by request. People like this song. It's not a new song, but we like it anyway. It's Three Bridges. A little song coming up. Locked in prison, I've been bound up tight. Trouble and change trying to stop my fight. Ain't nobody gonna go my bill. Oh, devil's jailers right outside my cell. I'm not Silas, I'll never be Paul. But they found me on. down with that hole.
Give him what you've got. Well, on Thursday, John Rulapa will be here for Throwback Thursday. John's had a pretty compressive career in gospel music, but on Thursday, we're going to be focusing on his time with the Dove Brothers. 
So that will be special on Thursday. And our featured artist of the week this week, that is the Collinsworth family. How about that? The Collinsworth. It all started in Petersburg, Michigan, 1986. Phil and Kim Collinsworth, they performed together on stage for the first time some 36 years ago. And today, God has expanded that ministry into a full-time livelihood, and it now includes their children, Brooklyn, Courtney, Philip, and Olivia. They have been voted favorite mixed group of the year 11 times. I'm not sure if any other mixed group has ever done that. I'll check into it. Either way, that's pretty impressive. Courtney Collinsworth, she's the blonde, I believe. She'll be here on Friday. It's going to be a good week. Here's the Collinsworth, our featured artist. Yes, I'm saved by mercy and love. Cleansed by the power of precious blood. Sweet salvation from up above. Saved by mercy and love. Saved by mercy and love.
set me free. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. I'd go until I find what the end may be. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. One day, one day I was walking along. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. I know I heard a voice, but I saw no one. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. The voice I heard sounded oh so sweet. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. Came down from my head to the soles of my feet. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. Get away, Jordan. Get away, Jordan. Get back, get back, Jordan. I wanna go over to see my Lord. Get away, get away, Jordan. Get away, get away, Chile, Jordan. Get back, get back, way back, Jordan. I wanna go over to see my Lord. I don't want to these mornings and it won't be long. I wanna go over to see my Lord. You're gonna look for me, child, and I'll be gone. I wanna go over to see my Lord. To hear more rises and settings of the sun. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. All my battles be fought and my victory won. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. All the friends I used to love so dear. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. Well, they've gone on the door and left me. I wanna cross over to see my Lord. When my feet get cold and my eyes are shut, biting and chewed by the hand of death. My tongue is glued to the roof of my mouth. Hands are laid folded across my breast. SouthernGospelPrizes.com has Southern Gospel Prize Packs that you can register to win. Currently up for grabs, the Southbound Prize Pack. Three winners will be drawn to win the new DVD, Southbound, live at the Franklin Theater. This features hits, address change notification, He's Got Away, Daystar, and more. Plus, each winner will receive Southbound's self-titled project on vinyl. Southern Gospel Prizes for Southern Gospel fans. SouthernGospelPrizes.com with the Southbound Prize Pack for all. Lord, it's me again Talking to my friend I'm grateful I can always count on you You know I've asked for help before for you to open doors And you've been faithful to forgive the foolish things I do But those were the prayers of a young believer And hopefully by now my faith has grown If you made wine out of water at a wedding day Make my life a greater song And let it be an anthem of your grace A symphony of praise Lifting up your name forever And Lord, let me live a melody That would sing of Calvary And all the mercies I've been The song of my life be music to your ears. I want to know you more like I never have before. I long to have a deeper walk with you. I want to make you smile, singing all the while. Every song you give, I'll sing it back to you. Let it be an anthem of your grace, a symphony of praise. Lift 
lifting up your name forever and Lord, let me live a melody that would sing of Calvary and all the mercy is I've been given then Lord, let the song of my life be music to your ears. your name forever and Lord let me live a melody that would sing of Calvary and all the mercies I've been given then Lord let the song of my life be music to your ears to your ears Music to your ears that's the brand new song from the Old Pass Quartet I've never met the Old Pass Quartet I'm going to look them up when I get to the Quartet Convention and maybe we can get a connection with them and get them here on the morning show Well, here's one we've never played before. You know I love a good bluegrass tune, and this is about as good as it gets. See you on the other side, Rick Ferris and Sam Bush. It's a good one. It'll get you going. We're triumphant, and you're listening to The Morning Show with Natalie. Music, ministry, and more. It's The Morning Show with Natalie Duncan Emmons. You're listening to The Morning Show, and now with your patriotic point of view, here's Larry Gresson. By the age of 26, Milton Snavely Hershey was penniless. With two failed businesses behind him, he was an unlikely candidate for success. Yet Mr. Hershey, a man with steadfast convictions and a limitless curiosity, turned his story from rags to riches by persevering and eventually selling his caramel company for $1 million to devote all his energies to making chocolate. Using equipment purchased at the 1893 World Columbian Exposition, Milton Hershey began experimenting with boiled milk, sugar, and cocoa beans in an effort to create affordable milk chocolate that could be mass produced. In a few years, he perfected his recipe, and by 1903 was breaking ground for a new factory in the town that bears his name. Unlike other industrialists of his time, Hershey's vision of a company town expanded beyond the brick and mortar walls of his chocolate factory. 
He built homes, parks, schools, public transportation and infrastructure, enriching the lives of those around him. His wealth was accompanied by a profound sense of moral responsibility and benevolence. When he and his beloved wife, Catherine, realized they could not have children, they founded a school for orphaned boys. In 1918, long before his death, Milton Hershey endowed the school that he and Catherine started with his entire fortune. The town of Hershey continues to be a special place for its residents and a popular attraction for millions of visitors annually. The Hershey Company is the nation's leading manufacturer of confectionery products, and Hershey Entertainment and Resorts continues to provide attractions and accommodations in Hershey that exceed guest expectations. Milton Hershey's accomplishments are his monument, and his life is truly an inspiration. I'm Larry Gressett with your Patriotic Point of View. The Patriotic Point of View was brought to you by Joe McGee Construction. Joe McGee Construction believes family is one of God's greatest gifts. Family owned and operated for the past 33 years, Joe McGee Construction is the proud employer of some of Mississippi's best tradesmen. Together, we are supporting our communities and working hard to ensure that every commute to work and every ride to school brings us safely home to our loved ones. Valuing faith, family, and the Magnolia State, Joe McGee Construction is building safer roads for a better Mississippi. Joe McGee is my friend, and I thank him for helping us bring you the best mix of Southern Gospel music, along with your patriotic point of view here on The Morning Show. Thank you. 
You're listening to The Morning Show, where we're playing fresh new hits from some of your favorites. Like this one from the old fast for 10. Following up that number one single, The Answer is Jesus, Karen Peck's got a new one, The Keepers. And a big new song by 11th Hour called Awake. Keep listening to The Morning Show for all the latest hits. Nothing ever 
giants We all walk through the valley Moments that seem hopeless And we're helpless to do Anything about it But if the one who left This is Southbound. This is your Monday motivation. And I'm telling you, we, we are all three worship leaders, and yet we still sing Southern gospel, and we just love worshiping together. But I just wanted you to know today that no matter what you're dealing with and whatever your day looks like, you can worship your way through anything. You might be at the top of the mountain. You might be in the valley. But I promise you, no matter what's going on, you can worship today. I love to worship you. I love to worship you. So hold on tight, hold on tight. 
want to make sure everyone has visited the new website. Don't forget about that, themorningshowwithnatalie.com. So if you haven't checked that out, we want you to do that. You can scroll to the bottom. You can see all about the new sponsors that we have. You can see about the Christmas Spectacular that's coming up in December. We just want you to see the website. So I want you to go out there and check that out. We also want you to follow us on Facebook. Uh, right now, it's under Natalie Duncan Emmons. So if you'll go out there and follow me, you can keep up with everything that's going on right here on the show. And you'll never be left out of the loop. You'll just know everything going on. Well, new statistics coming out of London just last week. They now say the average person leaves behind an online trail of 9,828 photos. That means at some point, the average person has posted 9,828 pictures on average. 
and 10,811 social media posts, 126 different email addresses during a lifespan. That's a lot of email addresses, 126. And one more, there's now an accepted statistic that the average person shares over one-third of their life online, actually 36%. So now the average person displays 36% of their life online. <laughs> wow. Who'd have thought? Lots of people doing it. Well, I think we're needing a little mercy this morning. Help us out, Jason. While I was sleeping, Lord, you were working. On the mess I made like only I can do When I start thinking I'm so far from you I wake up to hear you whisper that's not true Well, good morning, mercy You call me worthy Feels like the sun shining on my face Living's good this side of grace I Father just told 
We're glad you're listening this morning to The Morning Show with Natalie Duncan Emmons. Stay tuned. The best is yet to come. You're listening to The Morning Show, and here's your pastor's perspective brought to you today by Brother Larry Duncan from Salem Baptist Church in Lake Mississippi. Matthew's Gospel stands at a unique position in the canon of Scripture. It's the first book of the New Testament. It was written by a publican whose name was Levi, later would be changed to Matthew. Matthew was one of the original 12 disciples. Matthew's Gospel was written for the Jewish population, and it's the only book in the New Testament to be written in Hebrew. It's called the Gospel of the Kingdom. Over 50 times, Matthew used the word kingdom and the expression, the kingdom of heaven, is used over 30 times. It sets forth the Lord Jesus Christ as the king of the Jews. Matthew quotes more Old Testament scripture than any book in the New Testament, and he puts an emphasis on the miracles of Christ as the credentials of the Messiah. Matthew gives the genealogy of Christ, begins with Abraham, because Abraham was the beginning of the Jewish race. Someday, God will restore the kingdom of Israel and Christ will sit on the throne of Israel to rule and to reign. I'm Larry Duncan, and this is your Pastor's Perspective. The Pastor's Perspective was brought to you by Salem Baptist Church in Lake Mississippi. Salem is my home church, and I'm thrilled that they've partnered with The Morning Show to help us bring you, well, not only the best music in the world, but encouragement and words of life straight from God's Word. Brother Larry Duncan and the entire congregation at Salem, they invite you to come and visit whenever you get the chance. We're located just a few miles off of I-20 coming through mid-Mississippi. So if you live in our area, if you're ever traveling through our area on a Sunday morning, Sunday night, Wednesday night, well, you stop off the lake exit and visit with us. Thank you to Salem Baptist Church for bringing you your pastor's perspective. Listening to The Morning Show with Natalie.
My name is Natalie Duncan Emmons. You are listening to The Morning Show. If you go out today and look at the American Christian country charts for this month, sitting at number 23, you're going to find this guy right here. And I want to play it today on The Morning Show. I never really imagined us ever playing Morgan Wallen on The Morning Show, even though I am a Morgan Wallen fan. We've never really been able to play him on this show before until now he has a new song out that I think would be very appropriate. And obviously the American Christian Country Music Association agrees with me as he sits at number 23 on the charts this month. There are some gospel stations out there who will never play Morgan Wallen, but I guess maybe I have a different frame of mind than they do. We will play artists like Morgan Wallen. We will play the Steel Drivers. We will play Blake Shelton, Carrie Underwood, and Brad Paisley when they give us this kind of song right here. And why wouldn't we? We want more artists to put out gospel songs like this. Just makes sense. So believe it or not, here he is right here on The Morning Show. One man was praying, three men were sleeping, one was betraying the sinless son of God. Gone away from all the others Jesus and Judas Peter, James and John Jesus and Judas Peter, James and John Natalie with The Morning Show. I'm right here with a very satisfied customer of the My Pillow products. Tell us your name. Alton Gibbs. 
This is Alton Gibbs, and I, Alton is as good a friend as I've ever had in the world, but that's not what this is about. This is about facts right here. And I know, Alton, that you just recently got you a new set of sheets, those luxury Giza sheets from the My Pillow. And I'm having you on this morning because I want to know a word of testimony about these sheets. Tell us about these Giza sheets. They're great. They sleep good, they're comfortable, they're durable. The only thing, if you get your toe hung in it, it's going to break it. <laughs> <laughs> so Alton said, don't get your toe hung. That's the problem right there. <laughs> they're, they're not going to give. They just won't give. Yeah. Well, that means they're good sheets. Good sheets. Do you have the pillows, too? I do. Got two pillows. You got two pillows. So you've got two pillows and sheets, and you sleep on them every night. Every night. How do you feel when you wake up in the morning? I feel good. Yes, uh, this is good sleep. Get good sleep. Rest. Rest good on the pillow and the sheets. So that's it. Well, Alton, I appreciate you taking the time to say a few words about this product because I believe in them. I believe Mike Lindell's a good man, and I believe these products are worth buying. They are. They are. Can't you beat them. Can't beat them. That's what Alton Gibbs says, and he knows because he sleeps on them, and he's using these products. So you heard it from my friend right here. Alton, we appreciate you supporting the morning show. Well, that's, if you want a good night's sleep, get you some sheets and a pillow, and you are wake up refreshed every morning. One more thing, Alton. Uh, there's a promo code. If they go to MyPillow.com to order something, there's a promo code that they can use and get a big discount. Do you know what that is? Natalie. N-A-T-A-L-I-E. Did you use that promo code when you got your sheet? I did. Did you get a discount? Got a good discount. Uh, he said it was a good discount, not just some little old discount. It's worth using it. So go out there today. Alton said to do it. Go out there today. MyPillow.com. Use the promo code Natalie, and you'll be like Alton here. You'll get you a good night's sleep. Alton, thanks for your word of testimony. You're welcome. All right, we'll talk later. Come and listen in to a radio station where the mighty hosts of heaven sing. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. If you want to feel those good vibrations coming from the joy that his love can bring. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on and listen to the music in the air. Turn your radio on and glory share. Turn your lights down low and listen to the master radio. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Everybody is a radio receiver. All you gotta do is listen for the call. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. If you're listening, you'll be a believer. Leaning on the truth that'll never fall. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And listen to the music in the air. Turn your radio on. And glory share. Turn your lights down low and listen to the master's radio. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on and listen to the music in the air. Turn your radio on and glory share. Turn your lights down low and listen to the master's radio. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Turn your lights down low and listen to the master's radio. Turn your lights down low and listen to the master's radio. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Well, have you ever thought that things only go wrong for you or that everyone else lives by a different set of rules than you do? Well, Pat Barker, the bass singer for The Guardians, he says that's just not true. None of us are immune 
to the problems of the world. I mean, just because you stand on a stage and you sing gospel music, people think, well, they must have a life very different from mine. And the truth is, we do not. Um, we have issues. We have financial troubles. We have illnesses. We have family struggles. We have the same thing that they have. And even as a, a minister of the gospel, there are moments where it feels hopeless. And you look around and you go, where is God in all of this? And then if you can just hang on, if you can just continue to have faith, God's working everything out for the good. He who began a good work in you is going to be faithful to complete it. valley, but that's where I am. I picked up the pieces, tried to put them together, but it's so hard to stand. And Lord, I don't know what to do. I'm fully depending on you. My heart may be breaking, my soul may be shaking, and I don't have the will Circumstances may silence my song, but not for long. It's so amazing how you can turn sorrow to rivers of joy. You've given me peace that's beyond understanding the world can't destroy. Strengthen my faith, and I know that you'll make a way. I'll trust you completely and keep on believing when it seems like my last hope is gone. Not for long, I will walk on in victory, knowing you're right here with me when everything's going wrong. It's not for Circumstances may silence my song This trial will strengthen my faith And I know that you'll make a way I'll trust you completely And keep on believing When it seems like my last hope Wes. And this is Heather. And, and you're, you're listening, listening to The Morning Show with Wes Compton. No, Wes. The Morning Show with Natalie. Oh, yeah. With Natalie. I haven't taken over the show yet. Give it time, Wes. Just give it time. You will. Have a great day. Well, well. I know it won't, won't be long Till we reach that city In the air He went to prepare To prepare Well, 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 well. Pray up Pray up And always look up Look for my Savior, Savior Coming back In the cloud Well, trials and 
and troubles in your daily routine can get you sidetracked if you know what I mean. But my Lord Jesus, he's mighty and strong. He can fix your troubles and it won't take long. Well, 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 well. hold on, hold on. I know it won't be long till we reach that city in the air. He went to prepare. To prepare. Well, 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 well. Pray up, pray up. And always look up. Look for my Savior coming back in the cloud. Well, Jesus left, but he'll be back one day. So until then, never saints to pray. He went to build a place for you and me. Where we'll live together for eternity. Well, 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 well. Hold on, hold on. I know it won't be long till we reach that city. In the air, he went to prepare. To prepare. Well, 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 well. Pray up, pray up. And always look up. Look for my Savior coming back in the cloud. Look for my Savior coming back in the cloud. Music ministry, and more. It's The Morning Show with Natalie Duncan Emmons. You're listening to The Morning Show. And now it's time for a few moments of laughter with our friend and yours, Mickey Bell. Now I know none of you mothers down here in Mobile, Alabama have ever said this, but she would look at me when I was getting in trouble and she would say, do you want me to spank you? Since when do kids have options? Since when? Nobody told me I had a choice. My mother was the church pianist. And she, is that okay? Oh, Lord. She just played the piano. Have you met my mother? What are you doing? What do you mean, oh, Lord? She was talented. You church of God people are not the only people that can play the piano. My mother be sitting at that piano. I'd be acting up in church. My mother would come off that stage and apply her spiritual gift of pitch to the back of my arm. She would guide me down the center aisle of the church. As I was walking down the green mile, I thought it was a parade. So I was waving and welcoming everybody to church. That, pastor, is where intercessory prayer started because every person in the church started, Lord, touch his backside because she's about to wear him out. (laughs) I would get outside, and this is what my mother would do. Now, don't make me laugh because this is hard to do when I'm I'm laughing, so you got to do this. Here's what my mother would do when we got outside. Let me tell you something right now. (laughs) If you ever... Do that to me again. I'm going to knock you into next week. Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? No, I don't because you're not moving your lips. Enunciate, mother. Enunciate. Speak the truth, but enunciate. Enunciate. The comedy segment was brought to you by John G. Weatherford Incorporated. John G. Weatherford Incorporated, well, they're proud to be connected to The Morning Show. They're known to most as Weatherford Oil. They're a third-generation owned and operated family business that values God, family, employees, and customers. For over 40 years, they've been providing diesel, gasoline, motor oil, hydraulic fluid, grease, and logging supplies to some of Mississippi's best loggers, farmers, chicken growers, land managers, municipalities, individuals, and convenience stores. Whether you need large or small quantities, well, they'd love the opportunity to talk to you about supplying all of your fuel and oil needs. With two locations, they proudly serve Scott, Lauderdale, Newton, Smith, Neshoba, Jasper, Clark, Kemper, Rankin, and Leake Counties. If you appreciate Weatherford Oil helping to bring you the morning show, well, we would appreciate it if you'd call John at Meridian, 601-693-0981, 601-693-0981, or Jason in Forest, 601-469-3931, that's 601-469-3931, and let them take care of all of your fuel and oil needs 
We appreciate them. Night sky, thanks for the deepest blue in my daughter's eyes. And thanks for the weekend, thanks for a good friend, thanks for in the high life again. Makes me feel alive. It's been too long since we sat down and talked this way. But life is hard, sometimes I don't know what to say. But thanks. how the world seemed back when I was 19 maybe I just miss having things all figured out cause now I got doubts and I got these questions things I just don't understand but I bet you'll sort it out it's been too long since we sat down and talked this way life is hard sometimes I don't know what to say there are times when it just doesn't make no sense But you have been good to me You have been good to me time and again So thank you stop and talk to you a minute about J&L Farms in Lawrence, Mississippi. We've been talking about J&L Farms. You know about this grass-fed beef. Yes, it is high in antioxidants. Yes, it is loaded in lots of vitamins that you need. Yes, it is lower in saturated fat. It is good for your heart, and it's even got less calories than grain-fed beef. But today, I just want to say a word about Larry and Deborah Mathis. Larry and Deborah Mathis, well, they're just fine people. They run J&L Farms. They provide us with this grass-fed beef. And you won't ever find any better people to do business with than these fine Christian people. They can get your meat prepared any which way you want it. You know it's going to be good. You know it's going to be top-notch. It is elite meat. But you're dealing with people that you can trust, that you can depend on, that you can rely on. Larry and Deborah Mathis, they're exactly who you want to work with. I'm asking you to support Larry and Deborah Mathis over at J&L Farms because they help to bring you the morning show every single day. And we sure do appreciate it. And you will 
will enjoy this grass-fed beef. I'm telling you, if you ever get a hold of it, well, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. You need to call Larry Mathis today. The number is 601-917-8063, 601-917-8063. JNL Farms, we appreciate them. We appreciate you.
Well, High Road continues their European tour that we told you about last week. Sarah Davidson of the group, she sends a big hello straight from Norway. Check this out. Hey, everyone. We are doing our last concert tonight in Norway. And this beautiful barn behind me is where we were playing. It's absolutely gorgeous here. And we had a really, really great meal of uh, chicken stew and homemade bread earlier. And we can't wait to have a great evening with these folks. I think they're going to like it. And uh, we're going to have a good time. What a fantastic experience for those girls right there. They're getting it done. Ty Road. See a world around me that's in need Searching, looking for the answers When all they need is Jesus Jesus Maybe I'm the one to tell them Maybe I can make a difference So today Everybody, this is Scotty Inman, and you're listening to The Morning Show with Natalie. You might be that voice in the choir on Sunday morning. Or be a welcome smile for that new face in the crowd. Or be that silent prayer for somebody who's in need. God will move a mountain, and we can be the seed. Oh, save people, serve people, serve people, get saved. An act of kindness can shake the blind that's standing in their way. So 
Sometimes the best witness is what you do, not what you say. Oh, save people, serve people, serve people, get saved. They get saved. The world is full of lonely, broken hearts on every corner. But we can be a light to the lost and show them love. You might know the Bible quote, the hows and wins and where's. But some people don't care how much you know, then they know how much you care. Right. Oh, save people, serve people, serve people, get saved. An act of kindness can shake the blind that's standing in their way. Sometimes the best witness is what you do, not what you say. Oh, save people, serve people, serve people, get saved. They get saved. Featured artist of the week, that would be the Collinsworth family. We waited a while to get the Collinsworth family on the show, so we're pretty pumped up about that. Their Just Sing tour is underway even as we speak. It began August the 7th. It'll go through October the 22nd, and somewhere in between those two dates, they've got some 40-odd concerts. Good morning. It's been a good one. We'll catch you this afternoon on the morning show. Take 2, 4 o'clock Central. Lord willing, we'll be back in the morning. Don't forget, we're aiming high all day long. Have a good one. When the devil came up out of Georgia, he was feeling really low. He said, I'm going to have to work overtime just to steal me another soul. Then he came on up into Tennessee, where he found a fiddler named Dan. He gave a stump speech how he couldn't be beat with a golden fiddle in his hand. Dan stood toe-to-toe with the devil, he never bat an eye. Said gambling might be a sin, but I tell you what, man, music drives the devil out. Then he sang, I'm gonna climb that mountain, pull a chair up in the shade. Get my fiddle out, sing and dance about Ain't nothing gonna get in my way I'm gonna climb that mountain Gonna get on my knees and pray And when we sing and shout We'll drive the devil out It's gonna be a good day The devil threw a fit, he didn't like it one bit, so he sprawled and he jumped around. He made a really big scene, if you know what I mean, right there in the middle of town. No Dan didn't mind, he stood his ground, he never bat an eye. With his fiddle in his hand and an angel band, they drove the old devil out. Sing it. I'm gonna climb that mountain, pull a chair up in the shade. Get my fiddle out, sing and dance about Ain't nothing gonna get in my way I'm gonna climb that mountain I'm gonna get on my knees and pray And when we sing and shout, we'll drive the devil out It's gonna be a good day see the old devil with his fiddle in another town propped up on a stump he'll probably be drunk playing tunes with an eerie sound remind him about old dan and tell him he's heading into town and 
With his fiddle in his hand and an angel band, they're gonna send him where the sun don't shine. I'm gonna climb that mountain, pull a chair up in the shade. Get my fiddle out, sing and dance about, ain't nothing gonna get in my way. I'm gonna climb that mountain, gonna get on my knees and pray. And when we sing and shout, we'll drive the devil out, it's gonna be a good day. listening to The Morning Show with Natalie Duncan Emmons. We're glad you joined us. We want to invite you back tomorrow when once again you'll hear some of the very best in gospel music and some of the finest in Christian entertainment. Will you join us tomorrow? Is it a date? We'll look for you then. God bless and goodbye, everybody.